Lino. Hey, Mr. Chavez. It's Mr. Souza. How you been, pal? Uh, pretty good. Not too bad. Hey, I was uh, typing lawyer into my uh, yellow page thing, lemonless whatever it is, and your your name come up. Uh, you uh, you were lawyer. Mm. I am. Oh, interesting. Hey, uh, listen. Do you have any idea how I could get like uh, information from from uh, cases? For instance, the uh, I'm I'm not sure if you heard about the terrorism case uh, and how it was uh, <laughs> judged in the outcome. <laughs> It's funny you mention that because I don't think there's any legislation that I can find that I just got done trying to get fucking paperwork from the police department. It's like pulling teeth. And I don't actually think the Freedom of Information Act is in legislation. It's just an SOP, which means. Wait, it's a police uh, SOP? Or what, what do you mean I, it's an I, SOP? I, I don't see anywhere in this that so the police is stating that they get five days to produce reports. However, none of that is I can't find any of that legislation because it sounds idiotic. Um, and if it's not in legislation, but they're requiring five days, well, that means the state needs to be sued. You picking up on what I'm putting down? Well, you've got to be careful if you say the state's got to be sued because the police here might be retarded and they will think that that is treason because you believe that what the law says about the state can't be forced upon the state because that is going against the state. So, Well, retards can also suck my dick, so um, I have no problem with that. Okay. I mean, metaphorically speaking, sure. Um, so... You do you have any idea what the outcome was? Did they say at the court hearing uh, or anything? I I'm unsure. Um, I'm still trying to figure out why the fuck I can't get these documents that easily. Um, so what what is this about the terrorism case? Could you run that back? Uh, could you run that back? What are you trying to get your hands on? Specifically? I'm just trying to understand why they why it was accepted uh, the guilty verdict. What what was uh, what what was the reason that. We, you know that it was confirmed that they 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 were they were terrorists. Um, I talked to uh, Mr. K a little bit because I was in jail for apparent treason. So uh, I saw a lot of very big. Wait, you're not a cop? No, I haven't been here for five years. Apparently, I was fucking aliens or getting fucked by aliens with their tentacles. I should say. Were you oh. around when the purple shit happened? The weird purple shit. The purple. Sh Excuse yeah, a me. Long, a long time ago, there was like some oh, my, shit uh, Jaeger. Oh, pretty much, yeah. Like just, just like him, except there was some rift in the ground. Yeah. I jumped in there. I got stuck in there. Then I came out. It's just a, it's like one of those fucking alien movies. Honestly, we'll just pretend it didn't happen. But let's just say I wasn't here for five years. It's probably easy to 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 just to just say that. Okay. Um, what terrorism was, case are you talking about? I, I haven't um, really been around too much, so I, I'm not sure oh, what this... Oh, okay. Well, uh, apparently Chang Gang or some shit, uh, well, I believe they're still called that. Mr. Mr. Kaban mentioned he was put in jail for it while I was in jail, and then we talked a little bit about the laws and legislations, found the loopholes, and that's mm. why I was just trying to see if he was justifiably prosecuted, uh, considering I'm on similar, you know, hold the charges. I, you know, if I could see a hole in that case... But he got prosecuted. I could also show more uh, more holes for my case, essentially. Um, here's what I can do. Uh, I'll have a chat with him. Uh, mm -hmm. When were you arrested? I mean, if you give me permission to uh, pull your record as well for what you, you were charged you for, I can see if there's anything want, there. Uh, whatever the fuck you want. But I'm going to I'm going to court tomorrow. I've got a, a guy that's going oh. there, and most of our car, uh, our, tr our uh, shit is based on mistrial information because i read over the laws and if the if there is any right uh violated it doesn't say how long even if it's one minute two minutes if i get violated in any way that uh anybody involved in the proceeding from a lawyer perspective judge perspective uh must and is required to file for a mistrial. That's even on the uh, prosecutor side. And I told the prosecutor yes. yesterday that uh, you hadn't posted evidence or 
uh, the PC, but you posted on the docket to begin the trial, so technically, at that point, he must release me after 24 hours, and he didn't, so he violated my rights, so... Not only that, um, apparently their expert witness, who is a police officer and a part of the council, the council has an oath that says they must fully uh, commit to that government entity and no other, but also is a police officer, in which has a similar oath, so they're contradictory in themselves, which means, you know, they're in violation of the oath that they, they, they said to the state. So if anything, these guys are fucking terrorists at this point. Yeah, I've uh, only got done reading some of this shit, and I I, I don't think they actually finished uh, that thought process between documents. Yeah, well, I mean, the Constitution's the state law, and then everything after that's going to be local based on authority of the state. So uh, mm. the state, the, the first Constitution will override it all either way. As it's it's the main, uh, the, the, the main uh, focus uh, for, from that point either way. Hey, uh, listen. If you can get past the first three or four fucking parts of legislation without thinking everybody in this city has probably deserved of a some sort of mistrial, uh, good on you, because I almost wanted to fucking rip my own eyeballs out and shit on them. Uh, a few I just got in. done scream. Yeah, no, I just got done screaming at Mission Row, so I, uh, I'd be surprised if I do too. Uh, what time is the trial tomorrow? Uh, 7 EST or some bullshit like that. All right. Um, I mean, if you want to be there, that's fine. I listen, you know, my my, I uh, probably won't stay. I'm gonna walk in there. I'm gonna do my opening statement. Tell them to eat a bag of dicks and then leave. And if they arrest me, they're gonna violate my rights again because it doesn't say I have to stay in the courtroom. Uh, I just need to appear. So, you know, I've got a few plays. Hey, all right. Oh, I'm, I'll, I'll be there to observe. Um, It'll be a good show. Right. Could you send me a text saying that you give me authorization as uh, legal counsel? And then I'll yeah. uh, I'll pull your records as well. Okay, sounds good. Hey, uh, appreciate it. If you could, if you can uh, try find any on, anything on the uh, the the other case, that'd be appreciative too. I'm gonna go see if I can talk to those guys. Do you uh, happen to know where they hang out these days? Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I I, I figured they'd be uh, dead by now. Um, you know, I was surprised, but they're like cockroaches. A lot of these criminals, you see, they they just survive. The harder it gets, the better they get. Yeah, not wrong. Not wrong. Okay. Either way, appreciate hey, it. I'll uh, send you a message. Easy. Thank you. Thank you. Get that guy. I already talked to Robin. We're chilling. Hey, listen, I don't think it's gonna be relevant to the case, but we're pushing we're pushing the buttons where we can, either way, just to find the find how the process would even work. You know what I mean? So it's not a, it's not a big deal if it doesn't happen. It's more so just understanding how it could happen if uh, if we were. Wait, is Uriel the the guy that we were shit talking? Let me have a look. Oh, I didn't. That was a different phone. It was, wasn't it? Car sales, cosmetic mechanic. Damn, dude. Hello? Oh, hey, uh, Uriel, it's Soze. I'm just uh, finally free walking around. It feels so nice to be out of jail. Right. Um, out of curiosity, uh, what was your opinion on the, you know, being, being able to hold me for over 24 hours once the docket was created, but not, uh, you know, not having me released considering, you know, legally 
I should have been released according to the Constitution. Did you uh did you even know that was a thing? Yeah. Oh uh, it was a good faith argument related to the evidence, but yeah, I'm not gonna do that anymore. Interesting. Hey, uh as in what do you mean? You're not gonna you're not gonna release people no more? Or you are gonna release people. I don't get what you mean by that. You're not gonna do it no more. No, just hold people seventy two hours and post it in the seventy first. Oh. That seems to be the best way to do it. Yeah, I mean, it must have been difficult to think how could I copy-paste a statement uh, as PC into a uh, court document. <laughs> it must have been really hard to consider something like that that would take 33 seconds uh, to, to, to maybe ruin somebody's life for three days. <laughs> Who would have thought of something like that, huh? That's true. Yeah, and especially when the Constitution says to do it, you know... Even crazy. Well, I mean, at least you got to do what the Constitution says now and just hold them for the 72 hours. And, you know, uh, that's, the, that's, that's the moral of the story at the end of the day. Whatever, whatever uh, gets you to do the law legally is, uh, is better for everybody, I believe. Right, right. Hey, uh, what sort of cars do I mean, you sell? Uh, anything from Mosley's. Anything? Are you, uh, mm -hmm. What sort of car do you drive out of curiosity? I drive a few. I got an SUV. I got a motor car. Uh, I got a bike, but I can't really drive that right now. The fuck is a motor car? You know, like a sports car. Oh. People call them motor cars. Don't all cars have a motor? No, I, well, yeah, most of them. I mean, which one doesn't? Mm, you could probably push one with your feet, I'm guessing. Yeah, I mean, listen, I don't know if the Flintstones cars actually exist there, pal. Although you might be stuck in the Rock Age, uh, not all of us are there, buddy. We've learned to read. Right. We're no longer drawing crayons mm -hmm. on the uh, Constitution and the legislation. Our walls That's aren't true. made of uh, crayon anymore, pal. Were the walls made of crayons? Well, if you draw on them, kind of, yeah. Oh, okay. And technically, yes, because also... Uh, that would be the rock in which they would make their paintings from. Usually they'd scrape the rock onto the ground, put water in it, and that would be their paint, and they'd mix it into a certain color based on the rock. So technically, yes, every single cave wall could have been a paint uh, at the same time. Okay. Um, listen, I mean, uh, I just thought I'd ring you to see how you're doing. Um, out of curiosity as well, with an expert witness, is her expertise in writing legislation? Is that what uh, she's been pushed for? Yeah, correct. Hmm. Um, what's an oath considered uh, for you guys when you uh, say an oath to a government, uh, state government, uh, authorized entity like a police department or a council, for instance? Is that like uh, some, some, some binding by law or does it just mean they're impeachable if they lie uh, and fail in their oath? Uh, I'm confused. I know you're fucking confused, but I'm trying to ask you questions right. that you could uh, maybe look into and then le be less confused. Which part's confused? Well, the, I can uh, maybe read the oath to office is written in the legislation. Oh, um, doesn't it doesn't it say something about being in one government entity or something like that, and not not going into others like a police force or anything else? Uh, I'm confused. Where does it say that? I don't know. I'm just asking. I'm asking you questions. I'm not trying to yeah, confuse I'm asking you. I'm you just a question. asking you questions. Right. I'm asking you where it's written. Maybe in the second paragraph. I uh, can't really recall. Uh, I had somebody reach okay. out and tell me that there was something about a, an oath. Uh, I'm just worried that like, if that's broken by uh, the people that are prosecuting me, um, especially an expert witness who apparently wrote the legislation. <laughs> you know how bad that's going to look in the in the courtroom, right? For you, by well, the way, not me. Right, she didn't write that legislation. Right, right, right. But she became a police officer afterwards, and if she doesn't understand her own oath, or oaths, I should say, I mean, expert? I don't know, the whole cave drawing thing's starting to come back to me, you know what I mean? Me expert, me smart, type type feeling. You know what you know what I'm saying? Due process and all that's also in the Constitution. I don't know if it's a due process either, if it's not uh, equal on both sides. Hmm. 
You know so what? what part of due process has listen, been listen, listen, violated? Listen. How about this? You go get me one of those uh, Flintstones cars from your dad or your brother or whatever, and I'll uh, I'll see if I can uh, you know maybe hang around you guys and learn some things. Okay. Yabba dabba doo.